What's happening guys? We're back out in the shed today, working on some metal fab. That's right, uh, we're gonna move on to metal fab today. Um, we're gonna do the fiberglass kinda in the background and we'll update you as we go. They're just getting a little bit boring. So, uh, it's kinda poor timing. We just had to uh, return the uh, that Precision TIG 225 that we've been using for all the chassis welding. I had to return that today. Um, it was a buddy of mine, he needed it for a project, so we're without a TIG welder. Um, we still have the little MIG welder, so at least we can kind of tack things together. And I'm, you know, I'm shopping for a new TIG welder as we go. So today I want to get started on the roll cage. Um, we can't do the actual roll cage hoops because I actually need to borrow a tubing bender from another buddy of mine to, to bend the, the hoops. So what we can do though is get started on the mounting points. So in order to mount this cage, we need to have six mounting plates welded to the, the chassis and then the corresponding six mounting plates that'll go onto the roll cage and then we can build the cage off of that and then it'll bolt on and off. So um, today the goal is to get those mounting plates made and, and at least tack welded onto the chassis. But to do that, the first thing we gotta do is weld in another upright here in the chassis so that our mounting plate is at a node. So, um, yeah, I'm just gonna grab the bandsaw, cut some pieces and get to work. uprights welded in, let's grab a piece of cardboard and make some templates.
to make the uh, the mating pieces, the uh, the plates that are going to get welded onto the roll cage, and then they'll bolt into here. So we're going to do that before we weld these onto the chassis, so we can use these bolt holes as a template so that all the all the holes line up. So grab a piece of steel and get to work. drilled to bolt those two pieces together because I'm gonna take and grind I don't even know if you guys can see it I'm gonna take and grind along the line there cut the template out and it's gonna end up cutting through all the spots where we welded them together so we're using the bolt holes later but we got these done um, so the next step for these will be I'll take a piece of this like inch and a half roll cage tubing and weld it on as kind of a spur and then everything will come out of that so and then these plates will just bolt on and off um, I stuck two washers between these pieces as to account for like the body panel that's gonna go here the thickness of that so um, yeah that's where we're gonna have to call it an episode uh, we got quite a bit done. There we go. Oh, Jesus. There we go. We got quite a bit done. Um, we got those two pads made and then the, the mounting plates for the chassis. Uh, we're ready to start, you know, on the front hoop. We'll build the back ones later. So, um, yeah, that's where we're going to have to call it an episode. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Um, I really appreciate it. If you haven't already, hit the like and subscribe button, and we'll see you next week. I'm out of here.